Hello viewers, I'm Manju Tiyagi. I'm an ex-psychiatric social scientist. I completed my MSW from Institute of Social Sciences, Agra University campus. And I completed my block placement from Nimhans, Bangalore. It will be my pleasure to share my experiences as a psychiatric social scientist in a government psychiatric center with you. Because the aspirants who are planning to do MSW or who are pursuing MSW, it will be certainly beneficial for them to listen about all this. That what are the roles of psychiatric social worker and how this profession can be enjoyed and can we can choose this profession. So what a psychiatric social worker does in a psychiatric setup, I will narrate you in detail. So there is a teamwork in the psychiatric centers. Exclusively the doctor, the psychiatrist can't help the mental patient. Because uh, as the doctor discuss the problems with the patient having some physical problem, it's not so easy for the psychiatrist to discuss the problem of a mental patient so easily because he is not in touch of reality, he is having many mental stresses so he can't come out easily and psychiatrist doesn't have that much time that he can interview all the patients so thoroughly. So there is a teamwork. There is a psychiatric social worker, a clinical psychologist and the nursing staff and many other employees. So a psychiatric social worker takes the social case history of the patient in which all the details of the patient are mentioned. His name, his, his age group, uh, the status of siblings, at which number is he in the sibling hierarchy, is he in the orientation of, is he having the orientation of time, date and place. These all details are mentioned in that and about his uh, childhood, his uh, all problems of his social life. Uh, does he have some neurotic tra traits like nail biting, bed wetting uh, and so on. So these all things are mentioned in that and after reading this case history it becomes easy for the psychiatrist to reach some conclusion. And similarly a clinical psychologist he, uh, he pursues his interpretation psychiatric social worker is always helpful for the psychiatrist in the OPD as well as in the indoor wards. So because the patients who are admitted in the wards with them, psychiatric social worker is supposed to establish the repo and take their daily updates, what are the improvements, how they are responding to everything so that the note is written in the file and the psychiatrist when come on the round, <clears throat> he notices all these things. There is always a teamwork. Whenever the doctors go for the round, the whole team goes, the psychiatric psychologist, the psychiatric social scientist and the nursing staff and all. When the patient is uh, recovering, there are certain problems about their discharge because this is a drawback for the mental patients that uh, uh, their attendants hardly want to take them away soon. Because once they admit the patient, they want him or her to stay there for a long time so that he becomes perfectly alright. And while the psychiatric center and the psychiatrist, they always wish to discharge the patient as soon as possible. So there, there, are, there is a problem. What psychiatric social worker does in this, he becomes a link between the patient and the attendants. And he or she narrates everything to the attendants that patient is now almost alright and you can manage him or her at home, so it's better to take it. <coughs> if the patients who are uh, from distant places, even the telephonic contacts and later correspondences are done with them. And then psychiatric social worker helps in the discharge process of the patients in the mental hospital. And when they are in wards in the hospital, there are certain departments which uh, take care of the patient because all the time if he sits idle, he can't recover. So there are occupational therapy department, music therapy departments, they are sent to them. Occupational therapy and music therapy are the assets which help a mental patient lot. And this is the duty of a psychiatric social worker to decide where the patient is to be sent and how the things are to be managed. This way, psychiatric social diagnosis has got an important role to play in the recovery of the mentally sick. And after their discharge, the role is still remains. Because the patient is to be rehabilitated, how he works after the discharge is another issue. Because if they reach in the same environment where they cause the problem, the problem remains as it is. So this is the duty of the psychiatric social scientist 
to <coughs> rehabilitate the patient so that his problems doesn't relapse so i narrated you the details of uh, the role of a psychiatric social worker hope you got the outlines of this profession and you can think for this in future if you like my video please subscribe